What's up guys, in this video I will show you the Super Nexus ROM on my Galaxy S2. So previously I had shown you that how to install this ROM on your S2 and uh, if you haven't watched that video then uh, please uh, see the link in the description. So this ROM is pretty much stable and it is uh, just like the LG Nexus 4 uh, ROM or Google Nexus 4 ROM so first thing you're gonna see is the this is the lock here you can swipe here to unlock you can also edit uh, things here like camera and other thing swiping to the right you have your camera here so so this is the camera so it is called as the quick swipe widget of Android 4.2.2 Jelly Bean. So first thing you're gonna see is the fluidity of this ROM. This ROM is super smooth, no lag at all. Here we have our drop-down menu. By clicking this, you have your quick settings we have the battery we have the Wi-Fi connection here we have our sim connection here we can turn on airplane mode and bunch of other stuff you can also change the brightness so this is very much good so I've been using this ROM for an hour and I've just tried everything on it and there are some problems but it is stable very much stable very nice performance everything is working good as you can see I have restored my all of the apps previous apps you can see the speed of this ROM this is the <clears throat> dialer Now I'm going to show you the camera interface here. So this is how the camera looks. We have, we can change it to video mode. We can change the other settings here with this. On the other hand, we can change the flash settings and white balance and other settings. You can also enable the first firm facing camera so you touch to focus and here we go the picture by swiping to the left you get your pictures all of the pictures so the camera is also very nice the other thing that I will show you is the internet so this is the browser it is working very nice no lag so far the browser performance is better than the stock ROM because it is very fluid no lag at all pinch to zoom works also great now I'm going to show you the kernel and other settings this is the settings we get. We have Wi Fi, Bluetooth, settings here, data usage, storage apps. These are the same settings, but we have also some new settings. I'm going to show you here. We have these some cool new features like enhanced web accessibility, touch and hold delay. And we have the magnification gestures. We can enable large text. As you can see, the text is now large. So these are the cool feature in this ROM. The other thing that I'm going to show you is the security. You have also a new option of verify apps. I don't know what this uh, really does, but it is included in this ROM here 
here we have our display we have the daydream option here which comes with the Android 4.2 and about phone this is my phone model here GT on 100 and this is the Android 4.2.2 as you can see this Super Nexus 2.0 build number 3 and this is the kernel for your build, num build 1 number 1 so the kernel performance is not good it is just okay so so far this ROM is okay not too good because uh, I was playing a game uh, shine runner on it and the game was suddenly uh, collapsed uh, like the game hanged and my phone uh, rebooted automatically so in terms of gaming this ROM is not good I will not recommend you if you want gaming ROM then please stay on the stock ROM because stock ROM is the best ROM for gaming now I'm going to show you the messaging app we have a nice keyboard here for typing not very much new not nothing new here so that's it guys there's no no new thing but in terms of fluidity and smoothness this uh, phone is rocking with this ROM but when you play games like Shine Runner uh, the phone reboots itself like collapse as I said before so I will I will be doing a gaming review of this ROM in my next video and also benchmark uh, video about this ROM so stay tuned for that and also if you have any questions then please let me know and yeah peace out